So let me get this straight. You're still not managing your global adjustment charges. You opted in ahead of June 15 because your LDC rep told you to. You missed the peak on Monday that happened at 10 a.m. in the morning while you were having coffee and you're still struggling. What is this global adjustment and what am I supposed to do about it? Let me tell you a quick story. Imagine that 10, 12 friends go out to the bar one night. They, uh, they get a bunch of food, they get a bunch of nachos with extra cheese and they get some adult beverages and they end up racking up quite a bill. Now imagine when the bartender comes forward with the bill, four or five of those 10 or 12 friends have left. Well, the bill that they racked up as a group over the course of the night is still a substantial bill. But now the people who are left over are paying a larger portion of that bill. Global adjustment is no different. Everybody has racked up the bill because of investments in renewable energy, commitments to nuclear, uh, conservation programs, you name it. But in this case, the bartender has given an option to the people at the bar and given them a way to leave the bar early and without paying their tabs. If you're not managing your global adjustment, you're still stuck at the table, you're still paying your bill, you're paying for the nachos and the beer that your friend had, and uh, it's time for you to leave the bar too and figure out how do I minimize my global adjustment charges. Let us know at CEM if we can help you do this.